welcome back to the vlog. Today is Saturday and it's about <laughs> half eight, nine in the morning, a little bit later than normal. Like basically today, it's kind of like before reading week. So I wanna get my life in order, get my shit together, get my stuff together and plan out what I'm gonna be doing in reading week so I can use that time wisely because I have eight days off, I think it is. So that's what I wanna do today and then sort some stuff up for YouTube because obviously it's Saturday, which means it's an upload day and that's what we're gonna be doing. And also it's super dark. Um, look at this weather. I mean, it has been raining, which great. But like, I know it's autumn now, but that is a little bit depressing, to be honest. Normally I'd have a smoothie or a bagel or something in the morning because it's quite quick, but because I have more time, I decided that I'd actually want to cook something. So I had these Richmond meat-free sausages and two eggs. So uh, that didn't go well. Basically, within mm, two minutes of cooking my sausages, I set the fire alarm on. But I did not realise until that very moment that we have five smoke alarms basically just in the vicinity of where the kitchen is. So picture me just going round like almost spinning plates trying to waft off the fire alarms before I set the next one off and the next one and the next one and I just, by the time I sorted that out and opened all the windows, my sausages were black, my eggs were like, just, just look at it, it looks so sad. I should have just omeletted it to be honest because Oh, that's just depressing. But in other news, I have finished my thumbnail, which I did this whilst I was cooking the breakfast. Arguably, probably contributed to why it looks awful, <laughs> because I just got sidetracked. Passados cuatro meses, también entrará en vigor una revisión de esta herramienta jurídica, con lo que si el Ministerio de Sanidad y los consejeros de salud de las diferentes autonomías consideran que ya puede levantarse dicha herramienta. So recently, I've been trying to listen to my news in Spanish, which is what I'm kind of doing here, and also just keeping up with the news in Spain, just to kind of get a bit more cultural understanding. So I did that as I ate, and then I went onto YouTube and looked at and replied to some YouTube comments. So now I've had breakfast and I've written a little list in my diary about what I want to achieve in the next hour or two today before I need to start getting ready to go out because we're going out quite early. I've got to leave about four-ish. So yeah, the first thing on the agenda is update my student. I don't think I've done this for about two weeks, which probably has contributed to the fact that I was stressed last week. So once this is sorted and I've figured out what I want to do over the next seven days, I feel like I'll be in a better headspace. That's what I want to do now. So for my notice board, I feel like I experiment with it so much, but at the moment what's working is splitting it into classes that I need to prep for, putting the dates next to the class so I know when I need to do the reading for it, and then doing exactly the same for YouTube, putting video ideas down and then putting the dates that I want to film them or want to edit them by. That for me seems to be working very well right now. So after that, I wanted to make a reading week filming and editing schedule. So on the right hand side of my screen, I have my schedule for YouTube for the next six weeks. So there are all the videos that will be coming out, although it's blurred, so no spoilers here. And then on the left hand side, I was basically making a schedule for reading week and allocating which videos I wanted to film in that week and when I would need to edit them by so I can kind of get them out in advance. So I'm not going to be stressed out for next term. So that took me a little while just to try and plan what I want to be doing for this week for the next month and then after that I went on to edit a YouTube video which will come out next it will come out after this one so you know that is a bit of a spoiler if any of you can zoom in and read what the video is about and yeah by the time I'd edited this video it was time to post my video that came out because obviously it's Saturday so here you can just see me going on my Instagram and basically saying that the video is out and then promoting it and then logging on to YouTube and just seeing what was in the live chat. Okay, so now is the portion of my day where I'm thinking, I'm thinking this lighting's awful. I'm thinking that um, I wanna do a workout. So that's what I wanna do now. I think I'm probably just gonna do like strength stuff. Definitely do the arms because that's like my weakness at the moment. I have no upper body strength or very limited upper body strength. <laughs> and uh, then I probably am either gonna do abs or legs. We'll see how we feel um, depending on like yeah, depending on like what I fancy doing in about 25 minutes time. <laughs> 
So the first workout I did was centered around the shoulders and around the arms. All my workouts are on the Night Training Club app. I feel like I don't even need to say that at this point because you guys just know <laughs> that's where all my workouts are from. So I did the shoulder shaper from there, which basically involves using dumbbells, which I quite like. It spices it up rather than just doing body weight stuff. And then I thought I would do legs in the end. So I ended up doing glutes and glory, which is the first time I'd done that workout. And as you can see in the video, it involved these like big broad jumps which I was not a fan of, but it was quite interesting to mix up for the workout. And then I went for a run all along the Thames and it was kind of like the sun was going down as I was running, which I really liked. But at the same time, by the river, there's like no light. So as I was running, it was basically running into darkness. So I've, oh, it's a bit low, it's a bit low, there you go. Um, so I've just finished working out. I also went for a little bit of a run and just did 2K because I didn't really feel like doing anything after 35 minutes of like strength hit training. But I feel like I always like to do a little bit of a run just like to get out and about if I haven't worked out outside. So yeah, done that. Now time to get ready and then go out. So here you can just see me getting my outfit ready, basically all black, very, very creative outfit. And then I just had a shower, was doing my hair and makeup. And then getting dressed. Okay, so I'm ready now, bar, putting on lipstick. And I just made like a quick, quick something tweet. Um, basically nothing special, spaghetti with leftover passata. I actually feel like this vlog is just me outing myself as a bad cook, which I want to say isn't true, but evidently it is. And uh, yeah, so I'm going to eat this now quickly and then I've got to leave in like 10 minutes and uh, yeah. Then we're gonna go for some drinks. So as I was eating, I just watched a few YouTube videos. I normally try and keep up with content that my friends have created or just videos that I wanted to watch. Basically just getting ready now to go. I never know which way this goes. Is it that way? I think it's this way. Basically getting ready to leave. So cue the shots from central London. Is it that way? I want to say that it is. I want to say that it is. So we went to a bar in central London. It was called Be At One and it was actually very good. Cocktails were two for one. That's why there's so many on the table. Not that we're like, you know, big drinkers or anything. It's literally because it was two for one and they always take forever to serve you because they do it via an app. So you have to kind of get the drinks in for the night straight away. So that's what we did here. And then they kind of turned the bar into like a bit of a nightclub -y vibe. So no complaints about that. It's probably the closest we're going to get to a nightclub in the next six months. So it's the next day now and I realised that I did not end the vlog. So that was pretty much it for my Saturday. Now is when the, the graft, the grind, you know, begins and I actually have to start doing work. <laughs> so yeah, I hope you like this video and let me know if you want more vlogs in the future. I'll see you in the next video. I'll see you next time. Bye guys.